Everyone talks about the newly opened Apple Store in the exchange here X in Kuala Lumpur. And being an Apple user myself, of course, I had to pay it a visit. Now in this video, I'm going to share with you five things that no one has told you about the Apple Store so far and which I really enjoyed during my visit. And I'm adding on a six points just as an extra bonus so that even when you are not an Apple user, hey, maybe you become curious enough to visit the store just for your experience. Let's go! That is now the view from the outside already to give you a good view how it looks like in the inside. It really looks daunting. So huge! All right, let's go inside. There are three levels in the store that I will go through and all of them have a certain function or meet certain criteria. Good afternoon. Let's have a look at the ground floor first. Here you can explore all the Apple products available. Or hey, you can ask any of the 160 employees for advice. And look at all the space available. Even when it's crowded, it feels like there's enough privacy for everyone. The amazing part is I have got so many Apple products. And even though for years I didn't like it, but from 2012 onwards, first iPad, I love that one. It's cool. Oh, here's Apple teaching. Right? I can do part I can So this is how you. And also, interestingly, of course, when you buy a product online, here is a pickup spot for online purchases, which I think is good because getting a product like this delivered to your place at home might not always be the safest one, of course. As you can see, all the products are available and you can test them with or without advisor. At least that's what I think. I think it's time to go up and explore the other levels. Let's go. Now here we are on the second floor and you got the genius sections. That's how they are called. <laughs> that means basically the guys in the blue shirt, the Apple manager service representatives have dedicated sections and they help you by answering your questions regarding the different products and guide you through in much, much detail. And it's really useful. Here we go to the Today at Apple section. Now, what are Apple Today sessions? Well, Apple Today is like a training session. Rely on my iPhone whenever I wanted to do something. An employee called Apple Creative explains to those interested, like those guys sitting around here, certain features of their product, be it an iPhone, an iPad, or an iWatch, or anything else. Even I learned something here listening to their sharing about the iPhone. I think it's pretty cool, you know. About the store design and according to the website, the store is designed with high quality materials. And let's go at the third floor now. It's kind of the sightseeing tour and up we are. The third floor features a walkway and leads to the park. Let's just walk around and around. Oh, that looks actually fantastic, doesn't it? And many people like to be here. You can relax or you take pictures of what's going on below. Like this one here is a look at the second floor. It shows again the spacious design. There's sufficient space to walk around. And from the other side of the walkway, you can take a look all the way down. Now, don't go there or look down if you are afraid of heights. That would not be healthy, but if you look down, I think it's a stunning view. Now, let's leave the store now and have a look at it from the outside. You will be amazed. Look at that beauty from a bit further away. It fits so nice into the landscape. But somehow I feel it looks like a spaceship as well. What do you think? And then, hey, playtime. I started to play around with an Apple logo and I hope you enjoy that. It's beautiful. Cool, huh? But here's something else that I want to share with you. Let's look at the ceiling inside the store. This apparently is a glazed oculus. Again, I don't know how to pronounce it. 
it is functioning as a dynamic skylight. And again, I took the liberty to zoom in and really had a chance to capture some white clouds through it. I just like that. Now this three-dimensionally layer roof gives you as a visitor the best of Malaysian climate because it lets in the natural light without the heat from direct sun rays. I quote it of course from the internet from their website. I am not the smart one here. So now what makes a store so special? What is my conclusion? Well if you look from the outside the store and its design is just beautiful but best of all it's carbon neutral and runs on 100% renewable renewable energy. Now that's worth mentioning, isn't it? And what about the store experience? Well, the individual service is excellent. We had some exquisite explanations from those we've talked to. Secondly, I don't like to get pushed into buying a product when I'm just interested in experiencing it or watching it or playing around with it. And this didn't happen in that store and I think it's just great. It lightens up the whole experience. And what is also great, number three is that you can buy a product from anywhere in the store. No more queuing up somewhere at a cashier register. I don't like to queue up. So that makes it very easy should you choose to buy a product. I find the Apple Today sessions interesting, enlightening, and I, as a long-term user of Apple products, even I could learn something by just watching and listening and playing along. And I also like that they help you setting up a product after you buy it. I mean, that's something. If you ever bought a product, brought it home, tried to set it up by yourself and struggled along the way, I think that's really, really cool. I somehow feel that this store can set a benchmark for other retail outlets here in Kuala Lumpur. And as a sixth positive point, I feel like this place has a real positive energy. It's interesting. It has a real positive vibe to it. So yeah, I enjoyed my tour through the store and you most likely realized I was there various times and it won't be my last time. So I hope you could learn something about the store you didn't know before. And if you are in the exchange tier X, well, watch the video here right now because that is something that you could do after you visited the Apple store. But for now, terima kasih, jumbalagi and bye bye.